Friends, here our concept is system requirements to install Stackstrom. Let me go with that. See, officially Stackstrom runs under Linux 64 bit only and they are Ubuntu Linux and RHL or CentOS Linux. Be clear, it is not supported on any other Linux distributions, but we can automate tasks on any OS like Windows or any other OS. Right? Fine. Now let me go with system requirements for testing purpose. See, we know that for testing, we need low configurations generally. For production, we need high level configuration. Now these are the system requirements for testing. Dual CPU, 2 GB RAM and 10 GB storage. With these configurations, we can launch our required OS from any cloud or from VMware. Right? Suppose if we go with AWS cloud, then this is the recommended EC2 instance type that is t2.medium. Same way we have requirements for production. So these are the requirements for production server, production stackstrom, quad core CPU, greater than 16 GB RAM, 40 GB storage. And if you go with uh, AWS cloud to get your server for production, then recommended EC2 instance type is m4.xlarge. And one more thing, suppose if you are using Stackstrom for data center automation, then we need some additional RAM. Right? Fine. And finally, suppose if you split your file system into uh, partitions and mount points, then we need 1 GB for slash var and 1 GB for slash opt. Right? Same information you can get from your official documentation of Stackstrom also. That is docs.stackstrom.com. See here we have system requirement. Just open that and see. So here they are giving system requirements. That's it. Okay guys, thank you for watching this video.